Hey everyone, it's Emily. Today I'm going to be filming a quick little what's in my bag video. Um, I've seen a million people here on YouTube do what's in my bag videos and I always think they're really fun so I figured I should just go ahead and do one. Um, don't mind my hair. It is after work and it's hot. It's like 96 degrees out today so I just didn't want it on my head anymore. Just pull it up. It's not a day for hair. So, alright. To go ahead, I'll show you my bag. This is my purse. It is a large color block tote-ish purse by um, Nine West. I picked this up at TJ Maxx in the beginning of the spring, actually, and I've been wearing this since. I think the color combination is really fun, and it goes with everything. And I'm just loving yellow. I think yellow is the best color for just a nice pick-me-up. And it came with this little clutch inside. I don't use this very often just because I just not a fan of the material. Just don't really like that. But I love the bag. Um, I'm kind of over it though. I did stain it. Um, maybe you can tell. I'll show you. Can you see that pink on there? Ugh, what a bummer. I was wearing a hot pink t-shirt and it was raining and the hot pink from my shirt stained my purse, which is such a bummer. Okay, so here we go. The first thing that I pick up when I grab my purse is my wallet. This is an old, old wallet. It is a Juicy Couture. I got this probably almost 10 years ago and just keep all my crap in it. Got lots and lots of crap. And then it has this cool little front thing where I keep my business cards and um, receipts or whatever. So that's my wallet. My purse is extremely heavy. It probably feels like a ton of bricks when people pick it up. It's not the lightest. And then I also have my makeup bag. Um, this is also a Juicy Couture makeup bag. It's just this fun pastel. Um, I don't even know what kind of design that is, but it's sequins. So it's really fun. I think it's nice. It has this little container back here, which is cool. The thing that I... Don't judge me. This is embarrassing. The thing that I like most about this is that it is lined inside. So it's like vinyl. And this is what's inside my makeup bag. Oh boy. There's a lot of stuff. I have an eyelash curler because you never know when your lashes, well I know anyways, my lashes start to point downwards towards the middle of the day and I know you're not supposed to do this and I do it anyways but I just go ahead clamp it just very 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 gently a few times and I feel like it gives me a nice little pick me up. I don't know. I know you're not supposed to do it. it doesn't stop me. I'm not going to show you every single thing inside here just because we'd be here for the next like 10 years. Um, my favorite chapstick is this Bliss Tex Complete Moisture and it's an SPF 15. I like how this feels. It kind of smells a little bit like lemonade and it's just really moist and kind of cooling when you put it on too so I like that a lot. Um, basically what I keep in here is a bunch of my go-to neutral colored products so um, we'll go with everything they're just what I like I don't really I keep like one bright thing in my purse just because it's a pick-me-up product but this is my favorite lipstick right now. It is the Rimmel Moisture Renew in Dreamy. It's gorgeous peachy pink color. Love it. And then I have like my Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stain in Honey. I like this a lot too. When I'm at work I'll just put this on after lunch or whatever and I'm good for the rest of the day. Um, my, one of my favorite lip glosses is this Milani lip gloss in the color Summer Baby. Love that. And then my new obsession in life 
is this Dior Ultra, the Dior Addict Ultra Gloss Pearl in 157, which I believe is Twin Set Pearl. <clears throat> it's like my favorite right now. Super pretty. Keep that with me all the time. And then I carry a little tiny vial of perfume. This is Lancome Miracle. Love that stuff. And then I have a lip liner. This is just NYX Nude Pink. And then I have a little mini mascara. It's the Benefit They're Real. Super tiny. Um, just fits nicely in there. And then I have a little brush. It's my lip brush because one of my lipsticks broke. So now I have it melt, melted into a pot. I saw that come in. This little pot guy. It's my favorite lipstick, but it melted. And then I have my Smashbox Photo Op Under Eye Brightener. This thing, I don't really use this very often. Not a huge fan of it. I don't really think it does much of anything. You guys can be the judge of that though. I don't really think it makes a huge difference. Hmm. I don't really know. Hmm. Yeah, so that's all that I'm really going to show you of my makeup bag. You don't need to see everything in there. And then I have this L'Oreal True Match Powder. I don't use this necessarily for the pressed powder. I use it for the mirror. I am always in need of a mirror. Um, when I'm at work sitting at my little desk, sometimes pull it up, see if I look like crap or not. So I have this. I have a coupon for the Starbucks Via Ready Brew Refreshers. I love these. Love, love, love these. Um, the Very Berry Hibiscus and Cool Lime. So I have a coupon for 50% off. Ooh. Ooh, it expires soon. September. I'm going to have to use this bad boy. And I have a pencil and a pen. I have a lot of pencils and pens in my purse. Oh, so what I should probably tell you is this is the layout of my bag. Um, open, has one side compartment, the main compartment, and another side compartment. And then this side has a little pocket that you can put a cell phone in or whatever. And then it has this cool little dangling thing that says 9 West on it. And then I keep my little claw clip right here. I keep this on because it just works for me. It's easy to grab when I need it. Um, anywho, so back to this. I'm kind of just attacking the main compartment right now. Some hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works. Ooh, I've been looking for this. My NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss in beige. Yeah, beige. This is like my favorite lip gloss. I have some Altoids. Who doesn't ever want Altoids? These are the small ones, these small sugar frees. I just like them if I'm going into a meeting or something. I can quickly grab them, not have to chew gum to have my fresh breath. Oh, I have a rubber band for my hair. Always need a hair tie. And then since it's the summer and I am so incredibly pasty pale, I carry around my travel size. Hawaiian Tropic Silk Hydration Lotion Sunscreen SPF 30. And it's a 12 hour moisture. And this stuff is really good. It smells amazing. It smells like the typical Hawaiian Tropic. That yummy, beachy, coconutty kind of smell. Love this stuff. So I just kind of carry this around if I'm wearing a tank top or if I'm just out and about and I can kind of tell on my shoulders if I'm getting a little too much sun. I'll just put some more of this on. I have a little tub of Vaseline and I carry this because I wear a lot of heels. Alright, my dad. Um, I carry this little tub of Vaseline with me because I wear flats a lot. And I hate when, like, 
three-fourths way through the day, my shoes start to rub really bad on my feet and I don't want to get blisters because then I'm just crabby and miserable. So this does a really great job of preventing blisters. So I like to have that with me all the time. And then have a little calculator. This is a Weight Watcher calculator. I'm on Weight Watchers. So I like to carry this with me. It's a point plus calculator. It just tells me how many points are in whatever I'm eating. Um, of course I don't have any food with me right here. But if I'm in the grocery store and I'm trying to check the pointage on something to see if I can eat it or not, I check this to see how much it has. So I always carry that with me. And that's that compartment. And then in one of the side ones, I carry another perfume. This is the Marc Jacobs Daisy. I love the smell of this. I carry it with me though because it never seems to last. I don't, it's just not one of those scents that is long wearing for me. I feel like I'm constantly reapplying it, so I like to have that. And it's an easy size to carry with. And then I have an earplug in my bag as well because. I don't know why I have earplugs in my purse. Occasionally, super rarely, I'll go to the shooting range and need earplugs. Or if I'm going on a car trip and I want to sleep, they're good to have as well. Another lipstick. Ooh, I love this one. This is L'Oreal Color Riche in Tickled Pink. Gorgeous. It's so pretty. Love that one too. And then I have a whole bunch of just these mints that you get at dinner or whatever when you go out. Another pen. Ooh, a Tide to Go pen. This is the Walgreens version of Tide to Go, so it's clean to go. Um, this one's kind of funny too. It has this little, oh, yeah, it's stained. Don't mind me. I'm a messy person. I like to spill on my clothes all the time. Um, it doesn't have like a tip. It's kind of like a <clears throat> like a spongy applicator. So I like Tide to Go better, but this one was on sale. It's cheapo. And then in my other compartment, I have my car keys with my gajillion cards, my Sally cards, my Benny card, my Jewel card, my Pet Smart card, my Pet Co card. A Speedway card and a GNC card. I like my cards. Some Advil because you never, never know when you're going to get a headache. Um, two more pens. My favorite, okay, I said that the other one was my favorite chapstick. This one's my favorite tinted chapstick. This is the Burt's Bees Hibiscus Tinted Lip Balm. This stuff is amazing. So I'm just going to put it on. It just gives the prettiest tint to the lips. If I'm looking this way, I'm looking at my viewfinder. Sorry. Love this stuff. It feels amazing. And it just gives like a nice little color. It's kind of like the better version of my own lips kind of color. So this is good when I'm on the go. Um, what I have been passing by and not showing you... 50 million pieces is Trident gum. It's my favorite gum. Just the original. I don't really like any of the other flavors besides the original. The containers they come in suck. I hate, loathe, cannot stand Trident packaging. It sucks. It's always opening. It's falling apart. It's ripping. It's just such a hot mess. So I usually just end up dumping the gum out in my pocket on my purse. So at this exact moment in time I have like a whole little stockpile of gum just hanging out. And then two more items in my purse. I have a lip butter in creme de nude, right? Nope. Hot liar creme brulee. That's why you're supposed to read things before you say what they are. Creme brulee. I like this one. It's pretty. Um, it's nice for when I just need a little bit of something. I guess I really don't even need that one in my purse. And then this is my favorite lipstick to carry with me. Um, 
if I need a pick. They're so loud. If I need a pick me up, it is the Revlon Color Burst Lipstick in Carnation. It's just this really pretty bright pink, but it's not like super bright pink. It is just. This isn't even going to be the true color considering I have like 20 lip products on right now. It's just the prettiest color pink. It just like gives this nice glow to the face, kind of makes you look more put together. Um, so yeah, Revlon Color Burst in Carnation. <clears throat> I'm having a hard time finding these Color Burst lipsticks. And they're my favorite drugstore lipstick and I'm getting nervous that maybe they're not carrying them anymore. So I'm just going to hope that they're still around and maybe my Target's just not carrying them anymore. Um, yeah. So that is my purse and what I've got going on in it. I know there's a lot of stuff. Don't think I missed anything. Nope. Alright, so that is that. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you kind of got to see a little bit more. Oh, my phone. I carry my phone in my purse with me all the time. Um, basic iPhone, and then I have my cute new iPhone cover, which is the Kate Spade. Just picked it up at the Apple Store, so I guess that belongs in the What's in My Bag video, because my phone's always there. Um, yeah, so that is that, and I hope you enjoyed it, and if you have any questions about what anything is, if I didn't describe anything well enough, about my purse, anything, please feel free to let me know. I like hearing from you, and knowing what you guys are thinking, and if you have any requests for any videos you want to see in the near future, let me know and I'll be more than happy to film it. Um, I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you on the next video. Bye!